Hi everyone, my name is Gabe Armas. I am originally from California and I'm right now living in Yerevan, Armenia. Um, I am here after going to law school in New York City. I went to law because I want to do public interest type of work. I knew international human rights was kind of like my dream, you know, a naive dream, but still that was the idea I was looking for. After graduation, I was like, awesome, let's do something, let's do some good. And then I found out how hard it is to do human rights work in the United States. And when I was pondering my situation about what I could actually accomplish, I thankfully went to just a random party where I met an Armenian who told me about Birthright and Armenian Volunteer Corps. Doing a little bit of research, I found that there's actually a lot of possibilities here and that I could get phenomenal experience here. So, after chatting with some people in the Armenian Volunteer Corps, I submitted an application and I put as my number one choice, like what would be the one place I'd love to work, the Human Rights Defender's Office. I didn't think it was like 100% guaranteed, you know, here we're talking about, you know, the exact thing I want, but I got it. I don't know if you can tell from this, but I got it. I have been here since April, it is currently October, September, August, you can edit that out. Um, uh, uh, that, and it has been a phenomenal four months here so far. I have been able to work on very high level work that I'm very happy to do. Things uh, such as uh, providing recommendations for the domestic violence law, um, working on an anti-discrimination law, as well as very visceral down to earth stuff. Like there's these two old grandpas that had some land that the city wanted to take away and I found a legal hook, a legal evidence that would make it so the city couldn't just take the land away. And, you know, they were very thankful. That type of opportunity to be able to do both those type of work, uh, both types of work like that, is phenomenal. And for that, I thank ABC. Um, after being here for four months, you know, of course now I have to think. You know, I'm going to be going back to the U.S. soon. What am I going to be doing after this? And uh, the opportunities that I've gotten here definitely help in the United States. It looks great on the resume and whatnot, et cetera, et cetera. But then I realized one of the nice things about Armenia, like everyone that comes here, you know, they say, oh, it's so small, there's nothing here. You know, it's just rinky-dink compared to like, you know, shoot, New York City has more people than Armenia. But there's, there's a value in that. And the value is that when I'm in New York City, you know, here I am, you know, entry level, you know, junior specialist and all this, whatever term you want to use, most people won't give me the time of day because they're in the big shots, they're in the big leagues, and there's plenty of big shots and big leagues that they're all networking with. Coming here, people will actually give you a shot. They're like, all right, you're new, you're young, you're improving yourself, but you can meet with all the executive directors, you can meet with all the elite people for all the international organizations or whatnot that you're interested in, and they'll give you a shot. If you screw it up, you screw it up, but that's, that's on you. But you get that shot, and that is one thing I really like about Armenia.